Welcome to Tony Burns View with news you can use. As a chartered financial planner and wealth manager, Tony's passion is to help you retire early and live the life of your dreams with no financial worries. Now to today's episode. Benefits of Challenger Banks. Challenger Banks, also known as digital banks or neo banks, have been gaining popularity in recent years as consumers become more comfortable with banking online and looking for alternatives to traditional banks. These banks offer a variety of benefits that make them a great choice for consumers looking for a new banking experience. In this podcast, I'll explore some of the top benefits of Challenger Banks and why they may be a good choice for you. First and foremost, Challenger Banks offer a more modern and user-friendly banking experience. They often have mobile-first designs and offer apps that are easy to use and navigate. This makes it convenient for customers to manage their accounts and complete transactions on the go. Additionally, many Challenger Banks offer features such as budgeting tools, real-time transaction alerts and even rewards programs which can make Managing your finance is more enjoyable and less of a chore. Another benefit of Challenger Banks is that they often offer better interest rates on savings accounts and other deposit products. Traditional banks often have lower interest rates on savings accounts, which can make it difficult for consumers to grow their savings over time. Challenger Banks, on the other hand, often have higher interest rates, which can help consumers save more and reach their financial goals faster. Challenger Banks are also known for their exceptional customer service. They tend to have smaller teams and more direct lines of communication with customers, which can make it easier to get the help and support you need. They also tend to have fewer bureaucratic layers and are more agile in making decisions on customers' requests. Additionally, many Challenger Banks offer 24-7 customer support which can be a lifesaver if you have an urgent banking need outside of traditional banking hours. Another advantage of Challenger Banks is that they often have lower fees than traditional banks. This can make a big difference for consumers who are looking to save money and avoid unnecessary charges. Challenger Banks often have no account fees, no foreign transaction fees and no ATM withdrawal fees. These lower fees can add up over time and can help consumers save hundreds or even thousands of pounds. Another benefit of Challenger Banks is their focus on security and privacy. They use the latest security technologies to protect customer information and transactions, which can give customers peace of mind when banking online. Additionally, many Challenger Banks are also GDPR compliant and are transparent with the data they collect, use and store. Yet another benefit of Challenger Banks is that they save you time, lots of time. Time, of course, is your most precious resource. And most of us live busy lives these days, don't we? Lastly, challenger banks are often more innovative than traditional banks. They're not held back by legacy systems and can therefore offer new and exciting features and services. They're also more likely to embrace new technologies such as blockchain, which can make banking faster, cheaper and more secure. Let me give you some examples of my recent experiences with two of my own personal challenger banks. I have paid checks into my Starling bank account three times in the last couple of months from my kitchen table without even getting out of my chair. The process took about two minutes each time. You open the bank's app on your mobile phone, photograph your check, input basic details, then confirm the deposit. What's more, the check clears after two days, not three days, as in a traditional high street bank account. Unfortunately, some institutions still issue checks. I recently applied for a loan for home improvements on my Monzo account. It was an ultra short application. Not only was my application approved within 10 minutes, but the money had already cleared in my Monzo bank account. Lastly, I opened a business account with Monzo for one of my companies recently. It took about 15 minutes this time. There were a few more questions and more checks. I was particularly impressed by its link to Company's House, which facilitated the pre-population of some of my personal and company data. 
Not only was my business bank account approved in record time, but it was allocated an account number and sort code straight away. My bank card is expected to take up to 10 days to arrive in the post, but in practice it will probably arrive within a few days, barring another postal strike. These are just three examples of breathtaking customer service. After decades of experiencing appallingly bad service from traditional high street banks, especially for my businesses, I personally find Challenger Banks a breath of fresh air. In conclusion, Challenger Banks offer a variety of benefits that make them a great choice for consumers looking for a new banking experience. Whether you're looking for better interest rates, a more user-friendly banking experience, exceptional customer service, lower fees, or more advanced security and privacy features, Challenger Banks have a lot to offer. With more and more options available, it's worth considering a Challenger Bank for your banking needs. You know it makes sense. Thank you for listening to today's episode. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to share it with your friends and family. For more information, head to www.wealthandtax.co.uk.